In this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to pack down your XH 7.4 Expedition Hauler in the correct manner, ready to travel. The first step in packing down the main tent is to remove the spreader poles across the roof, all four of them, and the two little upright poles up at the end of the bed. Remove those, then we can lower all three bow poles, starting at the front, retract the bow pole all the way, lower the back bow pole all the way down, then lower the centre bow pole to its lowest position. I can now start unclipping all my canvas. Ensure you undo all the press studs. Do it both sides. Now we can fold the steps up. Fold them up and collapse the legs. Always ensure that you fold the steps right in close. Now we can close it up and use the key to lock it in place. Now all that's done, I can raise all my canvas skirt up, get it off the corners, off the back, put the rear bow pole down, and I'm ready to start closing the camper. The great thing about this is the electric close. So I can simply press the button to the, into the close position and the camper will start closing. The other beauty of it is I can stop it at increments and tuck my canvas in as I go before it comes down fully closed. I've stopped at this point for a reason. What I want to do now is make sure my tropical roof pole is sitting flat, so not back or sitting upright, but sitting flat towards the back of the camper. And I can push it in, make sure it slots in into the body inside here. That way it can't get caught, can't get bent. And I can start packing up, tucking in all my canvas around the camper, then continue on, bring it down further, tuck it in some more until I get the lid all the way down. Now to close the lid the rest of the way, once all the canvas is tucked in, nothing poking out, I've checked the front seal, make sure there's no canvas poking out of there. You just lean a little on the roof, clip that over here, put on my second clip, and whenever I close a camper like this, I always do it two latches at a time, and that way spreads the load over both and makes it a lot easier. Clamp it down, I can do the other side, the two across the back, and that's my camper packed. Packing up the stabiliser leg, simply put the speed brace onto the hex drive and wind it up. There's a lot of clearance under here, so you don't have to wind it up a long way. And lock it up into place. When you do, make sure that the handle locks all the way in and the stabiliser leg is secure. Before we hit the road, we need to pack up the Truma hot water system, which means returning the cover to the flue on the outside. To switch off the system, turn off your gas, then simply push the cover on, starting at the bottom, line it up, push it on at the top, and the little wedges will lock it in place. There you go, folks, that's the toy hauler all packed up, ready to travel. All you need to do is put your quads or your side-by-side -side on the back and you're ready to roll. For more information, go to marketdirect.com.au and check out our YouTube channel for all the other videos.